Shalom, the Lord bless you. I welcome you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. The title of this prophetic word says, Someone has your account details to send you money. Bert, there is a problem. I say it again. Someone has your account details to do the transaction. They want to send you money. Bert, there is a problem. There is a problem. Please, if you're seeing me for your very first time, my name is Ethel Betangba, and this is Prayer and the Prophetic with Pastor Ethel. You are very much welcome in the mighty name of Jesus. Amen. Hallelujah. Praise God. Thank you, Jesus. Hallelujah. Glory to God. Now, before I go ahead to explain this particular prophetic word, I want to say this. If you have a prayer request, you want somebody to pray with, you want me to be your prayer partner, or you've been praying about something, you need somebody to join you in prayers, please kindly get to my about. You're going to find my email. Send me a prayer request through my email. I will receive your prayer request by the special grace of God. Don't send me prayer requests through my website. It might take a while, please. Kindly send me a prayer request through my email. I repeat, through my email. The reason I say I repeat is because some people are still going to try to send it through my website. And it's going to take a while, please. I beg you. Now, this is what I do personally. If you send me a prayer request through my email, it gets to me directly. And when I'm not chance or if I'm not chance to read your email, what I do is I start it. I put it on a favorite so that when I have to start reading the emails and praying for them, I start, I get to that particular point and I read all of those emails and I pray. As well as there are emails I receive instantly, I read them and I pray instantly. There are some I respond to, there are some I don't respond to. So if you're sending me an email or a prayer request, I can read your email or your prayer request. I can pray for you, but I might not respond. Sometimes I respond as led by the Spirit of God. And sometimes I respond when I recognize some names that I know that I've been seeing these names frequently, like especially on live sessions and all that, or there are some names that I, I see sometimes also on seats. And not, not like I'm given a priority, but there are some names that when I recognize, I just cannot resist them. If I recognize, I always see this particular person on my live sessions and all that. Sometimes I want to reply you. And sometimes I'm just led to just pray for you and then don't reply you. I cannot reply everybody. I'm a very honest person. I'm not telling you the truth right now. Not everybody's going to be open to you the way I'm open to you, but you know what it is? People don't really like the truth. A lot of people get criticized for being truthful. And the people who are not honest with us, so they are okay. But it's better I know the truth and it makes me free. God bless you in the name of Jesus. Amen. So if you're sending me a prayer request, just know I'm going to pray with you. If you need direction, sometimes I just pray that let the Lord give you the direction. And sometimes I can give you the direction as the spirit of the Lord will lead me. So you must understand that it's not all. Oh, I've taken a long time to explain this. I'm sorry. Let's just go straight to the point. I'm so sorry. Someone has your account number to send you a huge sum of money. But there is a problem. Now, I want to say this. Recently, it's been a season of financial breakthrough prophetic words. Why? Because this has been that era whereby God has wanted to bless so many people financially. There are people whom the Lord to want to uplift their financial lives. There are people whom the Lord to want to bless them financially. And sometimes you might be one of those people. Sometimes you might find yourself in a group of that particular list. Now, there is always a season of financial blessings, not for everybody. You know, one thing about me is I love to connect to the blessings of others. There was a season I had plenty of financial blessings, you know, and there was a season I did not have any financial blessings. There was a season another person that I know had plenty of financial blessings and there was a season she did not have. So you know what I do when I see somebody with financial blessings and I know this is not my season. What I do is I connect to their financial blessings. It is not my season, but I'm connecting knowing God will bless me too. And sometimes I can share my financial blessings with somebody that I trust 
also because I know this particular person is going to connect and also receive an amazing financial blessings and be blessed. So that is what happens. Now, when it is a season of financial blessings, the Lord begins to release. But you must understand that the devil would always want to fight. There are people who are supposed to be amazingly rich by now, but the devil fought their financial blessings. How? The people received the money quite all right, but the devil manipulated them and they misused the money. And once they misused the money, what happens is their financial life dropped. There are people who have touched millions upon millions. But if you look at their life today, they have nothing. And then second category of people. Now you can find yourself in the first category. I'm going to pray for you. The second category of people I'm talking about are people whom every time you are at the verge of receiving a financial blessing, something always happens. It's you I'm talking about this prophetic word. Somebody holds your account number. They want to do a transaction of a huge sum of money into your account. But there is a problem. Them. There is always a limitation. There is always something that stops it. And this has happened not once, not twice. It keeps happening at the verge of your financial blessings. This job is going to bring a heavy financial breakthrough to me. This opportunity is going to bring a heavy financial breakthrough to me. Something always happens that closes that particular door. You are the one I'm talking to. I want to pray for you and I want to pray for the first category of people. If you believe and as you connect yourself to this particular prophetic word and prayers right now i release your financial blessings in the name of jesus i release your financial blessings in the name of jesus i release your financial blessings in the mighty name of jesus amen hallelujah praise god thank you jesus hallelujah glory to god Type it on the comment section, connect yourself, make that confession, say my financial blessings, say is released in the mighty name of Jesus, amen, hallelujah, praise God, thank you Jesus, hallelujah, glory to God. Please, if these have been of great blessings to you, I'll beg on you that you please pray for me as a spirit of the Lord who lead you to please intercede for me always. Please, I beg you, call my name in the place of your prayers. If you haven't subscribed, what are you waiting for? Please go ahead and share this amazing video. And please, I beg you in the name of the Lord, pray for me, intercede for me. God bless you in the name of Jesus. Amen. Now, may the Lord bless you, keep you, cast his face to shine on you. May he be gracious to you and may he give you peace, the shalom of the Lord. Nothing missing, nothing broken in the name of Jesus. I love you so much. I do. I love you. I do. God bless you amazingly and God bless you abundantly. I'll see you in our next prophetic prayers and in our next prophetic word session. I love you so much. God bless you amazingly and God bless you abundantly. Shalom.